Where the fuck you been, Scooter? You been hiding from us, man. What you doing? Damn it, Scooter, everybody on here been wanting to know, where have you been and what are you doing? We need to know what you're up to. But no, Scooter won't tell us that. Oh, hell no. He's got to hide, man. He's back He's back in Bastard, Virginia. And he's got his little girlfriend over at the bed, uh, at the bath camper in Bastard, Virginia. But they out riding on the four-way to those damn day. And old girl done left her damn children again, man, on fucking Easter, man. You know what? That's what she does, man. That's who she is. And I wouldn't expect anything less from that girl. Hell, fuck no, I wouldn't. I don't know. I ain't made a video in a damn while. I done got sick of this shit. I mean, I, you know, I just got bored with the whole scooter shit. It's the same old thing. He ain't never gonna fucking change. He always gonna be on dope or whatever the hell he's accused of fucking do. And he's always gonna be like that where, you know, all that bullshit everybody accuses him of. He's always gonna be like that. He ain't never gonna fucking change. His little girlfriend's always gonna be the way she is, in and out of their fucking kids' lives. Always propping up scooters for a little fragile fucking ego and chasing after his little fucking nasty ass. But ain't never gonna change, I don't know. There's only so many damn the ways you can make these little fucking videos. I mean, only so many things you can say, really. I ain't got a goddamn thing to say. Because again, like I said, they ain't gonna fucking change. They ain't, they, and all the shit everybody's trying to do, like making the videos and stuff, they're just doing that to be fucking funny and make jokes and shit. They ain't nobody, they, they ain't nobody in the right mind actually believes they're going to do any damn things going to make that boy stop scamming folks. Or stop fucking ripping people off or stop doing damn drugs. Because it ain't going to happen. It just ain't. Now, he may change one day when he fucking, you know, when he feels like he's had enough of that life, he might. But even then, that's a big if, man. I don't believe it will. I don't see it. As of right now, I, I don't see any damn. Uh, I don't think his prospects of ever cleaning his life up are very good. Because he don't think he's got no damn problem. Shit. I was going to try to come over here and be funny, but ain't nothing funny about his shit. It's funny watching the videos sometimes because of the outlandish shit he says and some of the ignorant shit he says. But, you know, I don't know. Man, it just, you know, again, what the fuck do you say, man? I don't know. I got caught in this little fucking thing for a while where I was like worried I was going to piss somebody off or fucking offend some goddamn body or, or God forbid you say the wrong fucking thing or you forget to say allegedly or some bullshit. Because Scooter always fucking threatening to goddamn sue every fucking body for making a goddamn YouTube video. The fucking outlaw himself. His first goddamn reaction to every any fucking thing that ever happens is either call the fucking law or I'm suing y'all. You know, because you hurt my feelings and you said something I didn't like. Fuck off, Scooter. Seriously. What the fuck? And uh, one of them boys on this YouTube, man, say he's going to go down to Boone County in July and try to kick Scooter's ass and all that. Hey, man, I don't, maybe he is. I don't know. Shit. I'm like, maybe Scooter will show up, but I don't think he will. If he does, he, he won't show up. He might try to get his big brother to show up for him and try to fight, but even then, what the hell kind of brother is Scooter to do that shit to Billy Earl? Billy Earl's got a, is a convicted felon, man. Shit. If he was to get catch an assault charge, he'd go straight to fucking, uh, straight back to damn prison. Shit. What the fuck's wrong with you, Scooter? Why the hell are you always trying to drag Billy Earl into fights and shit? You know damn good and well if that man gets caught up in a uh, assault charge, he'll go back to damn prison. You want your brother in go back to damn jail, man? Is that what the hell it is, Scooter? Fuck, man. Same with your cousin, man. You calling him Jack the Ripper and shit. You know, if that boy ever really for real was up for goddamn parole, you going around saying stupid shit like that and calling that man Jack the Ripper, talking about how he done, done kill people and shit on the, in the, while he was in jail or how he done hurt people in jail. You realize that shit got out, you'd block him into fucking up his chances of getting fucking parole, dude. You don't give a fuck about these damn people, dude. You don't give a fuck about your brother. You don't give a fuck about your cousin. None of these damn folks. You only give a fuck about yourself looking like a goddamn badass on the fucking internet over people that you ain't never gonna fucking meet in real life because you don't live nowhere near them and they don't live nowhere fucking near you. 
That and you don't ever even want to live the day, leave the damn house. You just want to hang out at the damn house and fucking play on the damn video games and fucking do whatever the hell it is you damn do. Get fucked up, smoke your weed, and do all that bullshit. And every once in a while, you'll go out and ride on your four-wheeler when you're back in the damn best Virginia. But it's got to be the best Virginia because goddamn Scooter fucking lives there. Anything Scooter fucking does is always the fucking best. And anything Scooter owns is always the fucking best. Even when it ain't. And anything Scooter does is always the fucking best. Because he's such a goddamn narcissist, man. That's why I always say his narcissism is fucking legendary. And that's like 95% of my fucking videos on here is just goofing on Scooter's narcissism. Because I'll be honest, man, I said this shit before, but I mean, I mean it, man. I don't, I don't hate this dude. I don't really give a fuck, man. I, I just get over here and go for hell, man. Like, a lot of people, though, man, they hate this dude, man. Like, damn, I don't know. I guess Scooter, like, reminds them of people they've known in their lives or something or, or whatever. He triggers something within people where they fucking hate this dude, man. I don't hate the guy. I mean, I don't like the shit he does. Don't get me wrong, man. I don't agree with him on damn near anything, but, you know, I think he's funny, though, man. I think he's hilarious because he's so damn, you know, he's crazy. And he, he's, you know, he's just so goddamn egotistical and narcissistic and, you know, he's just got such a big head over every fucking thing, you know. He's always an expert at every damn thing and he knows every goddamn thing. You can't tell Scooter shit. By God, Scooter be the one telling you what the fuck's up. Man, you can be a goddamn expert with fucking 50 years of goddamn experience in whatever the hell subject it is he's talking about. And you try to prove Scooter wrong or you try to say he even hint that he's wrong. By God, Scooter will be teaching you four nights out. Because he knows, man, shit. He read an article on the internet one time. Well, he didn't read it. I'll be truthful. I'll be honest. He didn't read the whole article. He probably read the headline of an article. And by God, he learned about that shit and that makes him an expert. And he knows everything there is. No. Or by God, his brother's cousin, sister's uh, aunt and uncle uh, knew a fella that, that was an expert and all that shit. And they told him once about something. And Scooter knows all about it now. And don't you fucking say he don't. Because we know he does. Because he's fucking Scooter and he's got them, his narcissism is fucking legendary. Like I said, man, he's, he's a goddamn genius in his own fucking mind. But to everybody else, he's, he's Scooter, you know. How can you hate that? How can you hate somebody like that? I get it being annoyed. I can understand being annoyed by somebody like that. But how you gonna hate a dude like that, man? It's fucking hilarious, man. It's fucking genius. I mean, it's not like if it was somebody, you know, like doing like a character or some shit, you know, like some parody shit. Hell yeah, it'd be fucking genius. But I mean, it's it's not. It's real, man. Shit. You know, you can't make shit like this up, man. It's fucking funny. But, you know, a lot of folks dug in, man. I don't know. I guess a lot of he, to him, to a lot of people, he represents, you know, that, you know, that loser junkie, you know, con artist type of person that we've all known in life. And I think that's what a lot of people just fucking can't stand. And that, he ain't always a very likable guy, Scooter Ray. He does have one fan, that mysteriously guy on uh, Rustin's little, uh, little live stream podcast, like whatever you want to call it, uh, that he does. That dude claims to be a fan of him. I think he's just, I think Rustin's right. He's just a troll, but he's funny, though, like with that shit. Sorry, I just went out and made seat bullshit. But, but, getting hot, damn it. I'm trying to drive and fucking fix all my shit and make, make a video at the same damn time. It's probably not the best idea in the world, but. And yeah, y'all don't give me shit in the comments for that. I already know it ain't the best fucking idea in the world, but damn it. I ain't made a video in over a damn week. I gotta record one, put something out, put something up. I don't know. But, uh, see, I'm curious, though, what the hell people think. What do y'all think of this, uh, Scooter Baggins dude going over there to Boone County in July to fight Scooter? Y'all think he'll show up? I don't. He ain't gonna show up. I mean, I don't doubt Baggins might show up, but I don't think Scooter will. Like the real Scooter, not Scooter Baggins, but Scooter Wayne. I don't think Scooter Wayne show up. Mm. Although, by God, I don't know, man. I think old, old Tom Link might have to... Might have to break out the news van and ride up to Western Virginia to see that shit. Get a front row seat. If I, if I knew for sure old Scooter would show up, I still wouldn't go all the way up there, man. That time of year, like, shit. I, I, hell no, man. I, I, hell no. I wouldn't take vacation time off from work to go do that. Oh, hell no. If I'm taking vacation time at work, man, you're going to find my ass down on the beach, man. Down on the, 
down in fucking Gulf Shores or Panama City somewhere with my damn freak propped up laying on the damn beach, man. Goddamn. <laughs> Soak it up the rays, some sun rays or some shit, man, you know. Hanging out with the kid, you know, playing in the waves and shit, man. I ain't, I ain't going to no best Virginia. Hell, fuck no. Hell no. I'd be down on the damn beach somewhere, man. Having a nice time. But yeah, I don't know. Old Tom Link might have to, might have to show up up there though. Not for real. I probably should pretend I was. I don't know. Like I always pretend when I'm in front of the meth camper, which I really am. Probably pretend I'm either in front of the meth camper or in route to the meth camper. But I, I'm never really am. I'm in, you know, I'm like four states away. So you know, I, don't, I don't even think I've ever even been to West Virginia. I think I might have been to mountains of Virginia ones like but just right across the state line from Tennessee like I ain't really go deep off in the lab but you know just up there you know just seeing the sights and shit you know but uh checking out the mountains and shit but uh, yeah there really ain't been a damn thing going on with this school shit there ain't been a damn thing going on with me I've been working fucking six days a week lately and just by the time I get off of work in the evenings, I'm just damn tired and wore out, man. I don't even want to fuck with this YouTube stuff, you know. I ain't give up on it or nothing. I'm still here. I'm still around, you know. Eventually, I'm going to start doing some different videos and just scooter shit, you know. Just just to switch it up because I get bored with this stuff eventually, but after a while. But, you know, I don't know. I can't say I'm going to be back on doing a damn video today or, or I mean, tomorrow or the weekend. You know, I don't know when the hell I'll be doing a video again. I might do one tomorrow or it might be another week. I, I don't know. I can't promise. But, but yeah, like I said, I was going to get over here and maybe do, try, try to do something funny, but I ain't, I, I ain't got night. I'm fucking tired. It's, it's already late. It's already down like 10 o'clock. So. Hell, it'll probably be tomorrow before I fucking even post this thing. It's damn late now. So if you're seeing this, it's probably already the next damn day. It's probably already Friday. But that's all right, though. You know. But anyways, I just recorded a damn video. But anyway, uh, let me know in the comments what y'all think about the damn uh, old baggage showing up up there at uh, Boone County trying to fight old Scooter. Y'all think Scooter and Billy Earl will show up? Because I don't. And damn it, Scooter, that's the other thing that pissed me off. I was thinking about that earlier, and I mentioned it in the beginning of this video. About him, always, Scooter, you always getting on there and damn threatening to get Billy Earl to go over and fight somebody for you. Dude, again, man, your brother done been, in, uh, been to prison in his life, man. If he was to catch a damn assault charge, they'd try to send his ass back, man. You ought not do your brother that way, man. Goddamn, dude. He's done try. He's done calmed down a little bit in life, at least to the point where he ain't gone back to prison since. Shit, man, you're trying to get the man back in trouble again. He's trying to fly straight, at least in that, at least, you know, a little bit, to some degree. Damn, Scooter. And dude, man, the shit with your cousin where you was calling him Jack the Ripper and all this shit. That's funny as hell, man. I give you that, man. The whole Jack the Ripper line always cracks me up when I hear you say that. But damn it, Scooter. Don't be doing that shit. Don't be saying that shit about your cousin, man. Because one of these damn days, he's going to come up for parole for real. And he ain't going to he ain't gonna want his damn family member fucking Scooter. Goddamn out there telling uh, lies and shit. Talking about, hey, damn, drop three people in the fucking prison or some bullshit. You know how they call him Jack the Ripper, man. It's fucking bullshit, Scooter. Cut it out. I got y'all here, folks. Y'all have a good night, good day, whatever. See you later. Bye, Scooter. Whatever your little girlfriend's name is. Fuck off. Go home to your kids, all that good shit. Bye.